Two of my nails broke off and they were so grown out so I thought I would show you how I remove my artificial nails and gel. To remove or soak off the nails you will need acetone, I just buy this one litre jug from Planet Nails. And then you will need one of these finger containers and a bigger container to put that container in. For some cleanup, you'll need some cotton pads, a nail file and just any sort of nail polish. So to start off, I'm just taking some boiling water and putting it in this bigger container so that the smaller container can sit in that boiling water. And then I fill my little finger container about half full of each compartment, I would say. Once that's done, I'm putting the finger container into the boiling water so that the acetone can heat up and then I just place my fingers into the acetone and during this time I just, you know, spend time on my phone, go on Instagram or do some emails. And after about 10 minutes, your nails should look something like this. The artificial nails kind of melt and they get all disgusting and gooey which is a good thing but we just want to continue soaking them for a few minutes I would say 10 to 15 minutes so once I feel that most of the gel or the artificial nail is soaked off I just take my file and just file as much of the artificial nail and gel off as possible but sometimes there is residue left so I just repeat the process between soaking and filing. And then I'm also just cleaning up the edges of my nails by just shaping them with the same nail file and then sometimes there is a little bit of the gel residue left so I take a little bit of that acetone on a cotton pad and just rub that clean. And then when your nails are fully clean and free from gel and artificial nails, I like to go in with a nail thickener. My nails are very brittle because I do wear, you know, gel a lot. So I like this Essence XXL nail thickener. So I just apply one or two coats of this. And then I do want to say that the uh, acetone does dry out your cuticles a lot. So going in with a cuticle oil afterwards is just so nourishing to your fingers. And there you have it, your nails are ready for your next manicure. I hope you guys enjoyed this nail video. Since you did ask for a little bit more nail videos, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe by clicking my picture on the left hand side. And you can also watch my previous nail video on the right. I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll see you next time. Bye!